welcome back to and this guides in today's video we are going to show you how to add an email address to the safe sender list in outlook on the web let's begin now the first thing you need to do is to log in using your credentials if this is your first time here on outlook click the create one option and from here just follow the on-screen instructions and you're good to go by adding an email address to the safe sender list you ensure that emails from that address are not mistakenly marked as spam or moved to the junk folder this guarantees that important messages are delivered directly to your inbox now let me give you an example on the uh list below here for example this email is safe all right and you wanted to add this to the safe sender list i need you just to uh, click right click on it click on the block and click on never block sender and what will happen is let's try this other email as well if that's gonna happen all right and when you add support that mail dot support dot microsoft.com to the safe sender list all right all i'm gonna do is click on okay because it will never send future messages from support at this email to the junk folder when you click on okay now the next option that you can do is hover to the upper right corner of the gear icon or the cog icon settings i need you to click on it and i need you to click on junk email and from here this is gonna be uh, the uh, safe senders and domains and don't move email from the senders to my junk email folder and of course you can add more email lists from here and this is the uh, safe mailing lists as well all right but again right now it's empty because as you can see messages with mailing lists often have an address other than your email address on the to the line now, if you want to receive email from a mailing list, add the address of your list to trust to the below box. Now, the thing is, it most of it, it's not all of the time that it happens. There could be a glitch or a bug that you can't add a uh, an email to the uh, safe sender list here. What I need you to do, if that's the case, you might want to go here and click on and contact the microsoft support and from here you need to select the product you need help with and that's going to be the microsoft 365 and which regards to the outlooks um, email address safe sender list all right thank you so much for watching we will see you again in the next video